It was riveting TV for political junkies. As we began to debate this bill on the Senate floor. Texas Democrat Wendy Davis went old school with an 11 hour filibuster of a controversial abortion bill. This particular motion because we had taken extraordinary measures to be here. That bill would virtually ban abortion in Texas. It failed to pass late Tuesday. A measure that would have banned abortion after 20 weeks of pregnancy and closed nearly every abortion clinic in the state. Lawmakers were facing a midnight deadline to vote on Senate Bill 5 before the special session ended. The only shot state Democrats had at defeating the measure in the Republican-controlled Senate was preventing it from coming to a vote. And what's so disturbing is that we don't seem to care. Davis took to the floor to begin her marathon filibuster around 11 a.m. She must have known it was going to be a long day, judging by her pink tennis shoes. By 10.30 at night, the YouTube channel live streaming this special session passed 100,000 viewers. But things really got interesting about 15 minutes before midnight. Senator Davis was found to be in violation of Senate rules when her point about mandatory ultrasound testing was deemed off topic, her third violation of the night. The crowd of demonstrators in the Capitol was outraged. In what's been called the People's Filibuster, more than 400 protesters cheered and shouted from 11.45 to midnight as lawmakers tried to hold the vote before the deadline. If I can have order, we will suspend the roll call vote until we can get order in the chamber. By this point, Twitter was erupting with news of the chaos. The site reported 5,776 tweets per minute about the story just before midnight. Even President Obama joined in on the conversation, tweeting, Something special is happening in Austin tonight. Hashtag stand with Wendy. Although some Republican lawmakers claimed the bill had passed before the session ending deadline, a timestamp showing the vote was completed after midnight later proved otherwise. The crowd of protesters inside went wild and began singing the Eyes of Texas, the alma mater of the University of Texas at Austin, to celebrate the death of the bill and a rare victory for state Democrats. For Newsy, I'm Elizabeth Hagedorn.